is Zachary Horn with Clean Code Studio. Clean Code, Clean Live. Today, let's learn some PHP 7.4. All right. So the next PHP 7.4 feature we're going to cover is um, the strip tags function. So this one's actually pretty cool if you're working on grabbing HTML or filtering HTML or whatever you're trying to do with HTML. So um, strip tags has actually been around for a while. And traditionally, well, I guess let's just show it. I guess it's easier to show through an example. So strip tags is as simple as this. The first thing we want to do is we want to create just a block of HTML. And we'll just say, let's create a div. And then we'll do an h1 tag. Um, and let's tab that out. And we'll do examples of stripping tags. And then right below that, we'll add an hr. And then we'll return the HTML to the front end. So when we return this to the front end, it should be h1. The text should be example of stripping tags, and we should have a line below it. So if we go back to our browser, reload the page, that's exactly what we have. Example of stripping tags, div h1 with an hr. So what stripping tags does, if we do strip tags, just like that, it's going to actually remove all of our HTML tags from the string. We go back here, we reload the page. Now all we have is body. It removed our div, our h1, and our hr uh, HTML element tags. So all that this new um, PHP 7.4 update is doing is just saying, OK, we used to have to pass it in like this, and it would say, we want to remove all HTML tags except the a element and accept the p element. Now we can say we want to remove all HTML tags except the a and the p element, but instead of actually passing in a weird string thing, we can just pass an array of the element names we want to um, not remove. So, for example, if we don't want to remove the h1 tag, but we want to remove the hr and the div HTML element tag, we can do strip tags, and we want to strip all the element tags from our HTML string except for the H1 element tag. So check this out. So we reload our page, and there we go. Everything is stripped except the H1. If we want to add more in there, we can do um, HR, and then we could do div to remove them all. But let's say let's just keep the HR. All we want is the underline because the underline looks cool, and we're stylish when we code. So if we go back, we reload our page. The only thing we have left is the HR because what we did was we stripped all of the tags from our HTML with the exception of the tags that we passed to this array. And uh, yeah, so that's all the update is for strip tags, guys. Now we can just pass an array of tags we do not want to strip when passing our HTML string to the strip tags function. Simple.